the conclusion to the 35th edition of the Student Yachting World Cup was in sight, with just one more day's racing to be sailed. Over the last week, 10 teams from universities from all over the world have gathered in Le Boule for what has been some challenging but enjoyable racing off the French coast. Today was the last chance for teams to find any chinks in their opponent's armour, with just two inshore races to decide the final leaderboard. The wind was the strongest it's been all week, making sailing conditions more extreme. Any mistake would prove costly at these closing stages with no opportunity to recover. The opening race of the day went to the team from Canada who handled the conditions expertly. The second then went to the defending champions from Southampton University. They were looking to knock the Swiss team off top spot and retain the crown they won 12 months ago. However, the leaders from Lausanne University sailed clever stayed in the top three in both races. It was enough to seal victory and become world champions for 2015. Last year's winners from Southampton finished second, with University College Dublin completing the podium in third. OK, we just finished the last race and we finished first, so now the stress is gone. These last few days uh, we have been working very, very hard to keep the lead. Uh, especially with the, against the defenders who have been uh, really, really uh, trying hard to get on top of us. But we managed to keep, uh, keep the lead until the end, so we're very, very happy. The team has been uh, working well, uh, especially being, uh, playing it safe, not taking any risks, uh, trying to lose as many points as possible. The celebrations would continue long into the night as teams relived what was an action-packed week and for many, they look forward to returning again next year.